In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to design an animated subscribe graphic in one app, CapCut, and then bring it into InShot and animate it as a sticker. Sometimes it's necessary to use multiple editing apps to achieve what you want. I'm using CapCut to design the logo because it has a few different font choices and the masking capabilities are a little bit better. One problem with all mobile editing apps, except for LumaFusion, which is a paid app, is that you cannot create shapes easily. In order to accomplish this, in apps that you can use for free, you have to use the masking capabilities. And I find CapCut's masking capabilities a little bit better than those inside InShot. CapCut is completely free to use. There are no in-app purchases or paid features. So I will quickly build a subscribe graphic inside CapCut. Then I'll bring it into InShot, animate it as a sticker, and use it in another project. CapCut works on both the Android and iOS platform. You can use your own photos as stickers inside InShot. Open an InShot project, tap on photo and select a photo that you want to use. The photo is already formatted to 16 by 9, so you need to remove the frame. The green colors are slightly different. Tap on the export icon to save this photo to your camera roll. Then tap save. Open up InShot once more and this time tap the video icon to open a video project. Tap new. Tap on blank clip. A blank clip will be added to the project. Notice the background is white. You need to change the background color so that you can use the chroma key feature to remove it once you add your subscribe sticker to a video. Tap on canvas, tap on background, and choose a green color. The reason that I had to remove the green color I added inside CapCut is because the green color inside InShot and the green color inside CapCut are slightly different. Now that the background is green, you can tap on sticker. Tap on sticker once more, the yellow stickers icon, Tap the photo icon at the top and tap choose from camera roll and select the photo of your subscribe logo that you created inside CapCut. You can place the sticker anywhere on the screen. However, I like to keep it in the center of the screen. That way I can make sure it's the right size. Resize the sticker by pinching and zooming. Next, you'll need to animate the sticker. To do that, you need to select the sticker and tap on the little pencil icon that will appear. Once you do, an animation panel will appear. Make sure the In animation is selected and select an animation that you like. The top row of animations can be used for free. Next, select the Out animation and choose the opposite animation to the one you chose, like this. Tap on the check mark, play your video clip once more, and this is what you get. Once you're satisfied, tap the export icon to export your video clip and save it to your camera roll. Tap save. The export has been successfully completed. Now you can add your graphic to another project. Tap video, tap new, and add your main footage. Play your video to the point where you want to place your animated sticker. You can either scrub through the footage or tap the play icon to play the video at normal speed.
To stop playback, just pause the video by hitting the pause icon. Once you've reached the location where you want to place the logo. Then tap the picture in picture icon. This will bring up the clip selection window once more. Make sure video is selected and select the video clip you just created in the last step. Position the video clip roughly where you want it over top of your main video. Then tap on chroma and select the green color, which will automatically disappear. Move the playhead back to before the logo starts and play the video at normal speed. This will show you what the subscribe logo will look like. If you need to, select the logo once more and pinch and zoom to resize and reposition the logo so that it fits properly over top of the main video footage you're using. Scrub back a little bit to the beginning of the subscribe logo, then make sure it's not selected. Tap anywhere on the screen to remove the white box, then play the video at normal speed. This will show you what the subscribe logo is going to look like when the video plays normally. Go ahead and export your video project.